Hey, what's happening, guys? Mike Moon here, and today I had got a very special delivery from Think Tank Photo, and I got this directly um, from them. And it is the Urban Disguise Shoulder Bag. This is version 2.0. This is the uh, Urban Disguise Shoulder Bag version 60. And um, what's special about this is that it has enough space for a 17-inch notebook, up to a 17-inch notebook. Now, I was looking at the dimensions just now, and I'm gonna have this all down there in the show notes so you can check it out yourself. Um, but for the most part, it should fit a MacBook Pro 17 inch with no problem. However, I'm looking at it right now and my FX gaming notebook just might not fit or might be a really snug fit in there. So definitely check out the dimensions if that's a huge consideration for you um, in terms of a laptop bag. Now what, what's really awesome about this is of course that um, the idea behind Urban Skies is that this looks just like a regular laptop bag. But inside, it is specially designed, of course, to carry and protect your photography gear. So there's dividers um, that allow you to, to hold up uh, two, three, maybe four camera bodies and maybe a lens or two or three. And in the front over here, there's even a section you can see these photos online as well, with a built-in divider area right here that will um, allow you to carry in the pictures two additional items in here, whether it be flash, two pro camera bodies without their lenses attached, etc. They also give you a Think Tank Pixel Pocket Rocket. I believe this is the SD version. No, this is the Peewee, which um, holds, uh, has space for a couple of SD cards down here and four compact flash cards. This works great, especially with a modern digital camera these days. This is, of course, detachable as well. Um, this is a fantastic accessory that is included with the bag. I want to show you the uh, camera's shoulder strap, which is actually very big and beefy. So this this is going to be this is going to mean extreme comfort in terms of carrying anything heavy for an extended period of time. However, in addition to all this stuff, I also got the uh, I also got some extra items to go with uh, with the um, Urban Disguise 60, and I'll show you that show you some of those shortly. But essentially, I can convert this into a backpack with a kit. So then I can just carry it like a backpack without having to strain one side of the shoulder or the other side of the shoulder, which is actually really bad for you. And I also got attachment straps for the side that fit right along here on these loops that will allow me to attach other modular accessories. So if you check out some of my other videos, I show you that I, I like to carry uh, the whip out bag um, that I can use to carry my water bottles over here on the side or uh, maybe additional lenses or some other accessories over here on the other side. So there's two additional sides that I can carry that stuff in there. Now the inside here, there's actually a section that opens up and there are dividers in there. I'm gonna show, show, show this on the, um, on the other camera that allows you to help you organize and, and fit other pieces of, of stuff in here. I'm gonna go step back inside and show you how I attach, well, I'm, I'm gonna try to attempt to attach the uh, uh, backpack straps here, as well as the uh, tripod straps down here, as well as the expansion straps right here in order to um, use the modular accessories. Let's, let's take a look from, first let's start out from the outside. Okay, I'm gonna put stuff back in, velcro it back up, and I'm also going to see if I can try to show you some of this stuff from multiple angles, including one in which I will be holding my camcorder. As with uh, all Think Tank photo bags, as long as you buy from an authorized retailer or reseller or from my link below, um, they all come with a lifetime warranty. And uh, with the Urban Sky 60, of course, you also get the uh, lifetime warranty as long as you are the original owner of the product. So um, I encourage you, if you're looking to purchase one, definitely get one new for yourself. Um, you'll never have to worry about it for life. 
Okay, some of the cool features of this guy. This guy can hold a 17 inch laptop. Okay, but as I mentioned before, the dimensions are actually quite slim. So this is the 17 inch notebook part. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to fit my Alienware or FX gaming notebook in here without a, without a major squeeze. So that's not recommended. But it'll easily fit any of the newer modern, um, non-thick, like non-saber, non-Alienware, super thick uh, laptop computer, 17 inch notebooks. So if you got a MacBook Pro, you're fine. Um, you, you don't really have to worry about, uh, about that fitting. Okay, so it features the laptop part and that was one of the main reasons why I wanted to get the Urban Skies because this does not look like a camera bag at all, right? It looks exactly like a laptop bag. Plain and simple. So um, that's a good thing. Now, uh, it's got other laptop bag related features, very similar. You can slide this down um, through the uh, carry, through the uh, handle portion of a, let's say like the carry on roller and it'll fit just fine through here. There's a zipper that, that allows you to close it up in case you want to use it to put in um, any papers or, or any other material, any other thin material as well. But if you open it up, then you can easily slide this right on top of a uh, roller bag, okay? So that's really cool. Another cool feature is that built in right here, you have a business card holder. So it's very handy. If you need to pass out business cards, um, just stick a couple of in there. This way it also helps you identify the bag as being yours as well. Um, put anything other important stuff in there that is pretty much credit card or, um, you know, paper fits really well in here. I also tend to like to stick in lens cleaner as well. I mean like a lens cloth microfiber in there just in case because it's really easy to reach. And it's got this nice little Velcro right here that also um, makes sure it doesn't fall out. Okay. Now you'll notice that there's some metal straps and loops right here. And that is because this will go with this kit that is called the shoulder harness kit. Shoulder harness version 2.0. And this kit is actually um, allows you to easily convert your bag, your laptop bag into a backpack type unit. So I wanted to be able to do that. I wanted the versatility of a backpack while still looking professional um, when I'm out in the field carrying my laptop and also be able to carry other things as well, including, um, I mean, you don't have to use this just for a uh, photo or camera bag. You can use this for any other thing that you want, but I primarily buy it because I can fit in um, a good sized notebook, laptop, or, you know, two netbooks, iPad, whatever. And also, I also carry um, my photo gear or video gear in case I need to, in, in case I want to do some shooting or, um, or some video making, video recording. And that's what this has. So I'm going to go ahead and open up this section right here give you a nice look inside what we got in terms of um, how it's set up on dividers. Okay, first thing, this guy is actually a very thick, well padded shoulder strap. See that? That is probably the thickest, probably most comfortable shoulder strap that I've ever seen to come with any um, laptop bag, laptop bag or um, camera bag, mind you. Now this surface right here is um, kind of rubbery yeah, and it helps so that it doesn't slip. This side here, of course, is just the standard, super ultra durable, um, feels like a Cordura or something super durable. I don't know exactly what that's called. And these guys, of course, strap onto the side of the bag, like right over here. Again, completely optional, don't have to use them. Look how, look how sturdy and, um, look how sturdy that is. That is one very solid, I, I could easily see this being able to handle 100 pounds easily. Not, not like you're ever gonna fit 100 pounds worth of stuff in a bag, but 
Um, I'm pretty sure this is way over engineered to last easily a lifetime or two. So these clip on, clip on, clip on over to the side. On each side, there's, of course, one loop on each side over here. And of course, it, it is adjustable. See, so just like that. All right, now inside, they give you a little booklet. Just basically shows you what else they have. You can check out my website or my link and you can see the most up-to-date information though. And inside we have some dividers, easily fit a pro-size digital camera in here with a lens attached. And I'm pushing down below, I know this is one of the more frequently asked questions is um, how much cushion is there. And the cushion is sufficient for, for um, like if I drop this bag, chances are my pro lens is going to be okay. Now I'm not going to guarantee that, but I definitely, there's definitely some decent amount of cushion and probably similar amount of cushion to what you see over here. So that kind of gives you an idea um, what kind of cushion is um, down there. Still keep in mind, camera gear, expensive glass, never drop it, try not to drop it. But I think it'll probably be okay um, in this bag from you know, if, if I put it on the shoulder for whatever reason it falls off, I think I think my camera gear is going to survive just fine. So this is default set up like this, but they give you a bunch of dividers for you to go ahead and configure any way you want. These are all standard and pretty held together with the uh, with with the Velcro. So that that's fairly standard, right? What's cool about most of the Think Tank bags is that they give you a whole rain bonnet. Basically, if, if it's if you're going to be in inclement weather you got to be outside, you want to protect your gear, they give you a whole cover that will cover the entire bag and protect it from water. So that's really nice to have. You don't have to keep this in there all the time. I'm in California and um, in California, as you, you can, Southern California particularly, it doesn't really get wet out. So you can also remove this as well. It's a nice touch, it's just Velcro. So just un-Velcro it out and there's a nice loop that it attaches to. And that way you get just this much more space. In fact, in, in the amount that is in this bag of space, I can easily fit one of my, um, uh, one of my uh, super ultra slim um, jackets for myself in case it does rain. So that's good. And that has a whole separate section back here. So you can see there's a divider here that you can also fit other stuff. Like I could, I could easily fit a book back here in this section in between you know, my camera gear over here. Okay, so that, that's the main compartment. And, and if you just want one big giant compartment, you know, these inside are just held together by Velcro, so you can easily remove that as well. 